Hello everyone, I am Vijay Kadbe and welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to understand the exit command inside the notebook utility. It exits a notebook with a value. So let us go to the Databricks workspace and understand the same. In this video, we will understand the exit command in the notebook utility. Let us begin. So here I am on the Azure portal. Go to Azure Databricks service. This is the workspace that we have created, Databricks-WS, launch the workspace. I'll open another Databricks workspace here. Then go to compute. This is the compute I have created earlier, cluster 01. It is up and running. Let us open the Azure Databricks documentation. Now search here, Databricks utilities. Go to Azure documentation for the same Databricks utilities. Go to notebook utility. The notebook utility allows us to chain together notebooks and act on their results. First, we have to create a notebook here. Go to workspace. Then go to users. Right click on the user and create the notebook. Let us connect this notebook to the cluster. Connecting and connected successfully. In this video, we are going to understand the exit command. So we will give the same name to notebook exit command. I will copy this command dbutils.notebook.help and execute. So there are two commands in the notebook utility, exit and run. In this video, we are going to understand the exit command. Let us see the information about the exit command. This method lets you exit a notebook with a value. You can see same here, exits a notebook with a value. I will delete these two cells. To understand the exit command, we will define a variable name. I will specify my name here. Let us print the same. Execute. In the output, we are able to see the my name. Vijay. Let us define one more variable. Address. I'll specify Pune here. Now here we will use the exit command dbutils dot notebook dot the exit command and specify the variable here. Let us execute this cell. Notebook exited, Pune. Let us define one more variable here as message. Welcome to Databricks. Let us print this variable. It is showing the output. Welcome to Databricks. Now note down an important point here. When we are executing this cell, after the executing this command, exit, we are able to see the output. Now let us run all. This is the output of the first cell, Vijay. This is the output of the second cell, Notebook exited, Pune. Now note down the output of the third cell, command skipped. And this is because here we exited the notebook. So this is how we can use the exit command to exit a notebook. You will understand more about this exit command in next video. So this video about understanding the exit command in the notebook utilities ends here. I'll see you in the next one. And do not forget to subscribe my YouTube channel. Thank you.